Hi everybody, it's me again for Let's Play the Urdra Trilogy, Dragon Warrior! How's it? So, I know it's been a while since I put anything up. I've actually been busy over the last week, and, you know, if I wasn't busy, I didn't have any energy. And following that debacle that was Mega Man X, I decided I was never gonna do this while tired again. So... As we continue our grinding, there's actually more that uh, that we need to explain. First off is the uh, Magician. A Magician is actually an enemy that you can run into if you advance too far past where I told you to. Okay, so all of a sudden now, it's a- there we go. So, before I continue, this is your Drakey. Uh, relatively tough in comparison to where we are, but really shouldn't be too difficult. Yeah, not too difficult and can and can hit relatively hard, but not too bad. Uh, it's the magician that I'm actually worried about, which is why I told you not to advance past this point. Um, in a nutshell, where we are right now, the magician will actually kick our ass because ten hit points. We're gonna be hitting them for ones and twos, while the magician, with in terms of physical attack, is gonna hit us for about three or four, and they, they know the spell Hurt, which will deal roughly seven to ten damage. So, you really don't want to advance much past here until you reach about level four or five. You know, just, just to avoid the risk of running into one of those damn magicians. Because they, again, they will hurt! Okay, so another thing that I do need to explain is another piece of equipment that we could have gotten from the very beginning, but didn't. I'm talking about the Dragon Scale. Eventually, we're going to invest in it. Basically, the Dragon Scale costs uh, 20 gold pieces and adds 2 defense power to you permanently. Which means if you wanted to, you could sell it and still uh, reap the benefits of the, uh, of the enhancement in your physical defense. Now, the reason I didn't, uh, I didn't invest in it was because we were so close to leather armor. And basically, I'm a guy that, again, I love good defense. When I finally get around to sports-related playthroughs, you're actually going to see this. I love good defense. Love it. Okay, so now it's about here. We want to use heal. And if you really wanted to, before you use heal, you can actually wait for your health to get down to about uh, two or three. But you don't want it to get too low. Because, yeah, what we're doing is we're going back to Tentacle. We're, we're going to be resting up for no charge. Um, the reason you don't want to get down too low is because, you know, you, you want to give it about one or two hits before they kill you in case something goes wrong. Now, I'm sure you notice that when you uh, select your command, you uh, you immediately act, but in case something goes wrong, you want to have that time to fix it. Now cast heal. Talk again. So anyway, back to the dragon scale. The reason I didn't invest in it is because we were so close to uh, uh, to the leather armor. Eventually we will, but what, I re what I'm really looking for is to improve my defense before I improve my offense, because your offense is going to get there. Uh, your offense is going to be there. In fact, as you level up, even with a defensive name like Minami, you're going to notice that your, def uh, that your offense skyrockets, while your defense doesn't. So, that that's why we're uh, uh, we're focusing on our defense before we're focusing on offense. And again, the dragon scale will just set us back too far. Yeah, it's only 20 gold, but the defense from the leather shield will help our immediate situation more than the dragon scale will. So I think that's about all I need to explain. I think. Let me go ahead and think about that while, while you're watching this grinding. I think that's all I need. Uh, sweet. Okay, so now we're at level 4. Sweet. Hit points by 6. la dee da Okay, so now we stand a chance against those wizards. Now we have the Hurt spell. You know what? Let's go ahead and show it off. Show how much damage it can deal. 
Oh, um, by the way, magic will never miss. Um, there might be times where it just doesn't do much, but magic will never miss. So, if you have the magic points, you know, for now, feel free to use it. Nice to stand an offensive advantage. But again, you can still potentially get your ass kicked. So, you don't want to venture, you still don't want to venture out too far. Okay, so now that I'm done explaining everything that I need explained, I think, uh, I'm actually going to go ahead and do some grinding. Uh, up, uh, I'm going to do, yeah, do my grinding up to 90 gold. All I need is 42 more gold pieces. Oh, uh, one more thing, by the way, while I'm here. I'll get in on my gold grinding later. But one more thing. The way you check your experience for now and the way you save is you come back up to the throne room and talk to the king. Ugh. Yes? Now, if you select no, the game will end and you'll have to, uh, you'll have to reset your game. But if you say yes, you can actually, uh, you can actually, um, continue. So, now that I'm done with that, uh, now I'm gonna do all my gold farming. Up to 90 gold pieces. Oh, and by the way... It's about now that it's okay to take on a wizard or two, but don't go hog wild on them. Because offensively, you're still just too weak. You still need about another level before you're offensively ready to, uh, to uh, fight a wizard. You know, drakeys, ghosts, slimes. And if you run into the, uh, to the scorpion, use hurt, don't attack physically. Their, off, uh, their defense is just too strong. So, now you can actually come to this desert. Don't actually go into the cave yet because the cave here just doesn't really pose much of a use. We're going to explore it only because it's here. But if you're looking for grinding, don't go in here. I'm going to give it away now. You're not going to run into ra any random encounters. Sweet. So I will see you all on the other side. All right, I'm back. Now, as you can see, we reached our 90 uh, our 90 gold goal. And on my way back, I did a little more killing, bringing, it, bringing our total up to 98. Now, the reason you're seeing me in front of Tentacle Castle is because, well, I ended up having to go back to heal. So now that we reached our goal, let's go ahead and pick up that leather shield. First, eight defense power. Okay, small shield. My, my mistake. No. Now, our next financial goal is actually 20 gold pieces. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. We're almost set defensively, by the way, in case you're wondering. Okay. That's not going to do... That's not going to help us out too much. But hey, what can you do? Um, by the way, if if you really wanted to, you could actually go up against uh, wi uh, wizards if you wanted. Um, might be a decent thing to check out. Look, let's go ahead and see if we can run into one. Um, and really, your basic strategy for that one is just use heart. I mean, if if that's all you do, they really stand no chance against you. You're you're you're, you're still not gonna hit them too awfully hard. But, you know, they can't beat you. Okay, so now that we reached our 20 gold goal, let's go back, grab that dragon scale. Now, the reason I didn't do so in the beginning, I'm pretty sure... Nice! 
that uh, I'm pretty sure I explained this was because the defense, uh, the defense provided by the leather armor and the small shield, uh, are are just. They're more welcome than that of the Dragon Scale. It's not to say the Dragon Scale isn't a welcome form of defense. All I'm trying to say is, it, it, it's just... In comparison, it's not worth it. it it's something that, that you can get... Okay, if I can quit walking around like I'm drunk. It's something that you can pick up off the side. And, and yeah, you'd get it from the tool shop. You actually would not get it from the, uh, from the weapons and armor shop. Okay, so let's go ahead and don the scale of the dragon, which by the way means put on. Equip. This is our new defense. So now defensively, we're ready to press on. Which is good because we're going to be doing so. Our, uh, our next financial goal is 180 gold pieces, getting the, the copper sword. Because this club is going to become very obsolete rather quickly. And by the way, we're going to be doing that at the next town. And if we can quit running into red slimes, I'll be, okay, uh, I'll be much happy. <laughs> All right, ghosts will work just fine. All right, what's this place? Hidden away in a cave. Okay. Huh. Okay, how come nobody's telling us what the hell this place is called? Garenham. <laughs> Finally. Okay, so let's see what they sell. They they sell. Now, normally I would say go ahead and keep grinding until you max out your equipment, but that's really going to take a lot of money. We're talking about 2,300 gold pieces, and to do so here, it's going to take a very long time. Now, again, we don't need the end, so let's go ahead, now that we know where we're going to be doing the majority of our grinding, let's go ahead and just stick around here for a little while. If you wanted to go south, you could. Just be forewarned, you're going to be running into some rather tough competition. Well, that works. Die. Oh, come on! Die already! Okay, so let's go ahead and use heal. Get some of our health back. And see what... Okay. And by the way, in case you're wondering, the reason I'm not using hurt is because of what we're... Uh, what we... Oh, come on! What we could experience down south. No sexual puns there. Alright, so let's fight one battle around here. This is the magician. Yeah, really all you want to do is use hurt and he can't win. We're, we're just not set offensively enough physically in order to beat this thing using our club. Sweet. Well, that works. So does that. Okay, so let, let's go ahead and return back to Tentacle, heal up, and then we can actually press on a little bit. I mean, sure, we haven't reached our 180 goal, uh, goal, but, you know, we actually, we need to find every bit of advantage that we can get.
wait. And um, by the way, in case you're wondering, it might not be a bad idea to fight everything. Oh, trust me. It wouldn't be a bad idea at all to fight everything, considering how much of a problem gold's gonna be throughout this entire game. Unlike Dragon Warrior 3, uh, which, by the way, I can at least somewhat understand, gold isn't a problem at the beginning and not so much a problem at the end. Gold's a problem throughout this entire game until you fully equip yourself. Okay, one more heal ought to do it. So it's about here. I'm going to go ahead and call it an episode. Coming up next, we press on and do more gold farming. Yay. I will see you all on the other side. Hasta lasagna.